<laughs> Hi there, welcome to my channel. My name is Leah and I've got wavy hair. Today I am going to do a showdown of gel versus mousse on fresh out of the shower hair. While I was out shopping today, I picked up some new mousse from Herbal Essences that is the Totally Twisted Curl Boosting Mousse that it has a sprunch away for weightless touchable curls all day. And I have definitely talked before about the Herbal Essences Totally Twisted Curl Scrunching Gel that is frizz free curls all day. Today to show you the difference in the two, I'm going to put one on one side of my hair and one on the other side. Can you guess which is which? Alright, let's get into the showdown. All right, so this is my hair fresh out of the shower. It's pretty much dripping wet. Um, what I did was I did my normal wash routine. So I washed it with the Not Your Mother's Naturals Yellow. And then I used the green Not Your Mother's Naturals Conditioner, combed it through with a wide tooth comb, and then put some curl cream in it. So I am going to be doing the Totally Twisted Curl Boosting Mousse on this side and the Totally totally Twisted Curl Scrunching Gel on this side. Um, these both have the same level of hold and they're both herbal essences so I thought this would be a really great way to um, look at what the difference is between gel and mousse on here. Okay, those two products are in. I'm gonna let my hair sit for about 30-ish minutes before I diffuse them. It has been about 30 minutes and I can already kind of see a little bit of difference. This side with the gel, already the cast is starting to form so I can see the curl definition is a little bit better. Um, this side still feels like the curls are a little pulled down, like this piece is still pretty straight um, and it's not getting the cast on it yet. So I'm going to diffuse both sides until it's dry and then we'll see how we turn out. Dry. So initially I have a few observations. The side with the gel, which was this side, it feels a little, it took a lot longer to dry. It actually still feels like there's some spots that are a little bit damp. The side with the mousse dried very quickly, which I appreciate. Um, so looking at the two, the side with the mousse has a little bit more of like a little stringier. So it definitely did get a cast on it. Um, but I feel like my curls are clumping better on this side. This side I feel like I have a little bit more curl definition and they look softer. But let me kind of crunch them a little bit and let's see how they look. So when I scrunch my hair, I always use the towel or the um, t-shirt that I use to dry my hair out of the shower with my hair. Um, just because I always have it on hand. And I feel like if there's a little bit of extra product in there, it doesn't hurt anymore. Like, look at that. I've got like a really nice clump right there. I'm just gonna separate it a little bit so it doesn't look like all one. I mean, I'm, I think that looks pretty pretty. All right, let's crunch this side out. But this side did not have too much crunchiness. Um, that is one thing I have noticed with this Herbal Essences gel is that the cast gets really soft when you diffuse it. Um, it makes a really nice hard cast, but then as you diffuse it softens up quite a bit. So this is the final result of the mousse and the gel. I do feel that the gel in this application did do a little bit better job. It formed a better cast on this side, so it kept the moisture in and I got a much better curl pattern. Um, this side, I still have a curl pattern and it still is curled and you know have my waves in it but it's not quite as defined as the gel side. I do feel like there's some real stringy sections in here that um, 
I feel like they're gonna look pretty straight by the end of the day, um, whereas this set will have some pretty good hold. In other news, I never part my hair in the middle and I think I kinda like it. Maybe this will be a new look for me. I will say that the mousse side definitely is not quite as frizzy as the gel side. It is a little bit smoother, but I can also see some sections that look like they're getting pulled down a little bit. Although they are very shiny. Like I can see this is a little shinier than the gel side for sure. All right, so that is the showdown of mousse versus gel on my hair. I've got like two C wavy hair, this low porosity. Um, I know for a fact that I really like to use mousse as a refresher product. My hair is second and third day with mousse looks great. I'll do another video on that um, because I got this specifically for that reason and my husband asked me what the difference was between the two. He goes, aren't you going to keep using your gel? I'm like, well, yeah, I need it to make a cast. Um, so. I think that's a really good showdown of what these two do. This will make a nice hard cast when your hair is wet and this is, for me personally, is really good for refreshing and brings a lot of bounce and curl to my hair on the second day.